Hey ladies and gentlemen, Professor Williams again, and I'm going to show you real quick how to do the net present value of a project where I have an initial cash outflow and then I have inflows in years one through four. Year five I have a cash outflow and then I get cash back in again in years six through eight. So I've gone through and I have cleared all of my um, keys, so I've gone to second, clear time value of money, um, I've gone to my cash flows and gone second, clear work, I've gone clear work, um, so I'm going to start. First cash flow is a $14,500,000 outflow, so I'm going to use the negative button and I'm going to say enter and then say down. And I know that um, I have no, I have a um, cash inflow in year one. Remember, this was my cash flow at year zero, which was my negative $14,500 that I had up here. And so I'm going to go my enter, and then I'm going to go down. In year one, I have a $3,625,000 inflow. I'm going to say enter and down. And I'm going to get that years one, two, three, and four. So I know that I'm going to get that flow for four years. And I'm going to say enter and down. Um, my second cash flow is going to be my $1,450,000, and that's going to be a negative, so I'm going to hit the negative, positive negative key, and I'm going to say enter and down. And I'm only going to have one of those, so I'm going to say enter and down. Now, what's my third thing that's going to happen? So I'm going to get my $583,333 a year, which is positive. So I'm going to hit enter and down. And the question is, of this third thing that's going to happen, how many years? I'm going to get it in years 6, 7, and 8. So that's 3.0 years. Enter down. Now I don't need to do um, four because I don't have a fourth thing going on and what I want to do is I want to compute my net present value. So it's going to want to know my I which is my discount rate which is 16.0 enter and then down and now it says my net present value is equal to and I'm going to hit compute and the net present value of this project is a negative $4.4 million and change. And that's literally all there is to it. Just remember that you have initial cash outflow at year zero, um, a inflow of $3.6 million in years one, two, three, and four. Then I have another cash outflow in year five which just happens one time, and then six, seven, and eight gives me three years of cash inflows, and I'm going to use that um, compute net present value and my discount rate of 16%, and I am good to go.